What's up guys, today I wanted to make a quick video going over NVIDIA Docker. In many of my videos, I use NVIDIA Docker in order to easily create a tutorial to run a variety of AI models, but I realize not everyone knows how to install NVIDIA Docker on Windows, so here's a quick tutorial on how to do that. So what is NVIDIA Docker and what is Docker? Well, the very, very high level overview of it is that Docker is a container system where you can install applications in an OS-like environment as if it was its own OS, but it is part of the host OS. So like a VM, but more so like an isolated build and run system. NVIDIA Docker just allows the CUDA drivers and GPUs to be inside of the Docker container, allowing us to run AI models in this isolated environment. So that's a quick overview of what it is and why we need it, and now let's get into it. So first, we need to install Windows Subsystem for Linux, or WSL, and to prevent any issues from occurring, we need to make sure that we have a high enough build number, so build 19041 or higher, or Windows 11, uh, but the simplest thing to do is just update your system as as long as you are on the latest version of Windows 10 or 11, you should be good to go. To install WSL2, we need to open up PowerShell or Terminal is what I use, but it's just a way to run PowerShell. And we need to run that as an administrator. So let's go ahead and do that. I'm going to run Terminal and I'm going to run it as administrator. Okay, and I've already done this, so I'm not actually going to I'm not actually going to run the command, but we'll type WSL install, and you're going to go ahead and enter that, and then after running this command, WSL should be installed, and you should be ready for the next step. For this to work, we need to have WSL two installed rather than WSL one. If you're just installing it now, you should be installing WSL2 by default, but let's go ahead and prevent any issues by checking which version we have installed. To do this, we can look at the docs and see that to list the version we have, we can use WSL-L-V. We'll go ahead and copy that, and we'll go ahead and paste it here, and we see that we are using version two for everything, and so we should be good to go. If we ended up not using WSL2, we can go ahead and change that by again, looking at the docs and copying the command like this here, WSL set version distro name two, or since Ubuntu is the default distro, you could just copy this here, WSL set version Ubuntu 20.04.2, and that will change your distribution to using WSL2. The next step is to install Docker Desktop on Windows. You can find the link I'm using by Googling install Docker Desktop and we'll use the first link. Go ahead and click this and download it. And you're gonna, you're gonna wanna keep it and then just wait for it to finish. After downloading Docker Desktop, go ahead and install it with the default installation methods as well as making sure that WSL backend is checked. After that is done, I will now go over how to ensure that the WSL backend is being used. We are now going to check to make sure that the WSL backend is being used. So go ahead and search for Docker Desktop. Open that up. And here we have Docker Desktop. So if we go over to Settings, and we see under general, we should see that use the WSL2 base engine. That should be checked. And as long as it's checked, and as long as you fought along with all the previous steps so far in the video, you should now have WSL2 installed, as well as NVIDIA Docker, and can now follow along with any other videos that I use NVIDIA Docker in. To now use WSL, it's as simple as opening a terminal or PowerShell, so here I have PowerShell, type in bash, enter, and now we are in WSL and we have a Linux environment. So if I run NVIDIA SMI, we have my GPUs and if I were to run a Docker container 
that needed NVIDIA GPUs, they'd be passed in and it should work just like it does in my video tutorials. If you liked the video, please consider leaving a like and subscribing. Thanks so much for watching and please have a great day.